Hey guys, Merry Christmas. Hopefully as you're watching this, you're having a nice holiday season. Back out here on the water today. Um, it's been awfully cold recently, which is one of the reasons I haven't fished much. Being from Texas, I really don't do cold weather well. But uh, today's really nice. Um, today's the 22nd, I believe. It's in the mid 60s. Um, it's gonna continue to be warm going into Christmas even. Now the water's still gonna be very, very cold, I think. Um, but um, hopefully as the water starts to warm, we can get on some a um, little bit more active fish. That would be nice. Uh, I'm going to be fishing with the Mystery Taco Box Pro today. Haven't uh, opened it up just yet to see what's inside, but we should have some uh, really nice baits in there. We'll give the slam a shot, but honestly, that's not the main focus today. We really just kind of want to come out here and uh, relax and um, take advantage of this nice weather. See if we can catch at least something. That would be nice. So uh, stay tuned and let's uh, pop this box open. All right, let's pop this bad boy open. See what we got to work with today. Mystery Taco Box Pro. Oh my goodness. We have a giant soft plastic swim bait from Optimum Baits. The uh, boot tail um, version. Uh, I've picked the right body of water, I can tell you that. Those of you that watch the channel a lot know where I'm at probably. This is a big bass lake and this is a big bass bait. So this is going to be a big player today. I'm guessing they gave us some hooks for it. Yep, so here's some uh, weighted swim bait hooks. This is a 9 aught size with the screw lock. So um, that's what we're going to use to rig the swim baits. Uh, also got a um, pack of soft plastic grubs, looks like. A uh, medium diving crankbait from Baker Lures. This looks to be a greenish black color and some finesse worms from uh, Mismo looks to be a sort of a June bug color or red bug probably is the color and to finish it off we have a, a top water this is the sunfish from live target very cool bait doubt this one's gonna work today though but uh, if we have time we'll give it a shot and see uh, what we can do but definitely the uh, star of the day will be this giant swim bait. Um, and also we'll be working the crankbait quite a bit. We're gonna cover some water as quickly as we, as we can just to see what we can hit on and hopefully uh, uh, catch a little something. So let's get at it. Alright guys, so location number one was a total bust unfortunately. Spent a few hours trying to catch something, couldn't do it. So I'm out here a few days later at location number two. It is Christmas Day, so Merry Christmas. Um, out here fishing for the first time on Christmas Day, never done that before. So it'd be really cool if I could catch something on December 25th um, with a bait from the Pro Box. So um, we're out here in an old farm pond and my options are a little bit limited because it's heavily silted in, a lot of vegetation. So the idea um, is going to be to use a drop shot worm. This is a small finesse worm they gave us from Mismo Bait Company. Nice red bug color. So we're going to drop shot that, give it a shot. It should um, at least give us a, a pretty good chance of catching something out here and that would be really cool on Christmas Day. So let's give it a shot. There's one. 
Not too big. Not too bad though. All right, so there it is, my first Christmas Day bass. Very excited about that. But uh, really the main point of the video, guys, was to wish you all a very Merry Christmas, a Happy New Year. I really do appreciate you continuing to watch and support the channel. It means a lot to me, and I really do wish you and your family the best during this holiday season. We will see you next time. Now, choosing which baits to use can be one of the more fun aspects of bass fishing because there's just so many different kinds to try and experiment with. We're going to briefly touch on all the basic categories of baits so that you can start to familiarize yourselves with those.